This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. Hello, welcome to Make Easy. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to hack any Wi-Fi nearby you in very easiest and simplest method and works 100%. And we'll demonstrate how to do brute force attack also. Okay, how to hack the system? First, let's understand how we can do, what is the process? Okay, when any device is trying to connect to the Wi-Fi network, that is router, then the device may be your smartphone or laptop or computer, any device, send a handsec file to the Wi-Fi or router. While sending that handsec file, that handsec file contain user ID and password to connect to the Wi-Fi. So while sending, we have to capture that handsec file and then we have to decrypt that using brute force attack or any other method. Then after decryption, we'll get the password and then we can connect to the Wi-Fi. That is the simplest method to hack the Wi-Fi. Okay. So if you have followed my previous tutorial, I have shown you how to connect TP-Link USB Wi-Fi adapter in Kali Linux and use that. If you haven't, you can just watch that video and do that. Okay. Now go to USB option and you can see this check mark is here in real tech. Fine. Open terminal first of all. After opening a terminal, give super user access by using sudo su command. I will provide you all the commands in the description below. You can copy and paste and try it by yourself. It's very simple. First command is we need to check whether our WLAN0, that is this one, is in monitor mode or not. Yes, this is in monitor mode. Now you can execute the command. Okay, if this is not in monitor mode, you can just follow my previous tutorial. Yes, I have explained everything there. Now you need to execute one command, aerodump ng WLAN0. When you press enter, it will display all the Wi-Fi networks available nearby you. So as you can see, here are the few Wi-Fi network nearby me. And we'll try one hacking in this. Okay, I will just try on this free Wi-Fi. You can say BSSID. That means the MAC address of the router or Wi-Fi or hotspot. Then decons, this is the value, power. This will determine how many, how much far the Wi-Fi network or is nearby. Data. If data is changing, then lots of devices are connected to it and sending and receiving of data is happening. Most important is here, channel. In this last one, you can see the channel is 9. So we have to capture the handsec file using this BSSID, that is MAC address and the channel, in which channel it is working. And the MB. Okay, fine. This is okay. This is using WPA2 security method. This is very much secure. Okay, fine. We have to copy this MAC address we need and then channel number. Now, another command we need to execute here is let me show you. Aerodum ng hyphen hyphen p ssid. The same thing we are using here bssid and then MAC address of this. You can just type it or a copy and paste in simple word. You can just copy. I have tried already. The same MAC address is here. So I have pasted that same MAC address here. And then hyphen hyphen channel for this channel. Channel number is 9. And then hyphen hyphen write. So when we capture the handset file, where you want to store those data? I'm creating the file called hack from which WLAN jail. This much you have to press enter. When you press enter, the process is running now. And here you will see handsec something massive here. When you see that, that means your handsec file is captured. Now you have to try brute force or attack to find the password. Okay, this is processing. When any device is trying to connect to the network, then only handsec file will be captured. Then what to do? Okay, if these two devices are already connected, yeah, this one and this one, this station you can see, this is. MAC address of the device which is connected to this network, this Wi Fi network. Okay. So if devices are already connected, so now we need to disconnect those devices and then those devices will be trying to connect again. Then we can capture the handset file and we can crack the password. So, okay. Now open new terminal again. Gives super user access. Okay. I'll give you all the commands. Do not worry about that. And then you can try it by yourself and it works 100%. Okay, now try here play ng iPhone iPhone D auth. 
that means we are disconnecting the device how many times the device must retry to connect we can mention here 10 15 20 50 20 50 100 as your choice 200 okay i'm keeping at 10 iphone a we have to mention the mac address of the router or wi-fi or hotspot iphone e then which device you want to disconnect from there that network uh, go to this option you can see 28 and 82 which one is that mac address 28 so i have copied that already this one i mac address i have already copied i want to disconnect this so if that device try to connect again then handset file will be captured how many times we are allowing that device to retry 20 times until it try 20 times it will not going to connect and when it is trying 20 times the handset file will be captured that is the main tax okay if you press enter okay this is trying to connect one two three four this is 20 times and if you go to this one this terminal and say file will be captured during this still not done let's wait for a while okay not then again let me do this once more so yeah you can see wpa handshake is captured this much now you can close this and you can just it is also done handshake file is captured in the another terminal if you write here 2000 or 2 uh, 5000 10000 or million something like that so what you are doing is you are blocking any device to connect to the network without connecting to that wi-fi network you can block that in this way okay so let's go to this Okay, handsec is WP handsec is captured. In which folder it is captured? So we have mentioned that in our previous command. In which folder we are? Home Kali. And the file name is hack. So let me write ls command to check. As you can see, hack 01.cap, hack 01.csb, hack 01. something something. There are lots of files. So we need one file that is hack. 01.cap cap file we need this file so now we have this file we need to extract this let's try brute force attack to decrypt this file okay now we have to type a command here crack iphone nc then we need to mention the file name x 01.cap that is already here slash uh, hyphen w to mention the word list from which word list you should try brute force attack in my case uh, in kali linux it is already provided to you slash usl slash share slash word list slash rocky.txt if you are trying first time in kali linux then you have to extract this txt file this will be available in the zip format so you can use unzip command by going to this folder and then we can use this in my case i have already extracted so this is fine okay now you have to press enter and it will start brute force attack and it, it will give you password yeah within very less time we got the password key found one 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 eight times one this is the password of that network if i show you by disconnecting this wi-fi network and connecting back again let me forward this okay i uh, forgot and let me connect again by typing the same password that is displayed one two three four five six seven eight you can see eight times one i'll connect to this and it is successfully connected in this way it works thank you for watching hope you are clear with this concept and you can create your own uh word list also in a text format just by opening text document and type the keywords and there are multiple methods to do this you can try it by yourself have a good day and try it by yourself thank you for watching see you in the next video please don't forget to subscribe like and share this video with your friends